Hey guys, what's going on? It's Carl here, back with another episode of Geared Out as we try to get through some of the backlog that's been in my email inbox, but we have another solid episode today, which is episode number 15. But before we get into that, we of course had a winner from naturally episode 14, which was... Ooh, this one was a close one. Congrats to Nick with 52% of the votes. You won episode 14. And just be sure to vote for your favorite contestant on today's episode, linked right up in this area on the card system and I will be announcing the winner naturally in my next episode which I wanted to tease something I've lined up a pretty sweet sponsorship so I'll be giving a ton of money away from that sponsorship money to the winner of episode 16 plus to one of you lucky peeps for watching Geared Out as you really seem to love this episode slash series so big big thanks to everyone and make sure you stay tuned to that which should be in around two or so weeks. With that in mind, you'll probably want to submit your very own Geared Out setup. Info is listed in the description box, and if you don't happen to, remember you can still win something by watching this episode and naturally subscribing to the channel. I really can't ask for anything more than that. Enough of me blabbing, we've got my laptop out. We are rolling with the contestants. Number one, we've got Joey, who has a ton I guess MacBooks, two of them. The classic black MacBook, which I remember seeing from my undergrad days and a 2016 MacBook Pro. You also have an iPhone 6S for your smartphone of choice. You're keeping things Apple, keeping once again, things Apple, like I mentioned, an Apple Watch Sport, and that is the leather band. Let me know how that's wearing over time. Third off, you have a pair of AirPods, and I'm really curious if you've managed to lose a pair as I've lost three of mine, sadly, already. For your choice of headphones, you're rocking a pair of Sennheiser Momentum 2.0s, and those are right under 200 bucks, which is a really solid option. A Lacey USB-C 2 terabyte hard drive, which of course is orange, so I never can complain with anything orange. Camera-wise, this is where I'm really starting to drool, and I'm kind of jealous at your setup here. You have a Leica SL. Your lens game is also on point, a Leica M50 millimeter, and these lenses are super, super pricey, a 11 to 23 millimeter, and once again, that's right under $2,000, so hat off to you. I know it's not always about money, but you do have Leica, so thumbs up. A Joby Grip Tight, which I'm sure you're rocking with one of your smartphones, probably your iPhone 6S, a solid little tripod for those. You also have a Peak Design Slide Red Strap, which I've kind of been eyeing. I know it's a bit pricey, 65 bucks, but I think it's awesome. And you also have a pair of Snapchat Spectacles. Haven't listed the price as I don't even think they're available here in Canada. Still hard to get in the US. And I also see that you've thrown in a little Charizard character just like me. This is an amiibo. I think that's pretty dope. Thank you very much, Joey. Switching on over to entry number two, we've got Noah. You're kicking things off with your Toshiba laptop. I'm not too sure if you use that for work or personal use. Smartphone of choice, you've got the Samsung S5 Neo. Let me know if you're planning to upgrade to the S8. Camera-wise, Sony A5000, and that retails now for 500 bucks, so that's a pretty solid option. A Samyang 12 millimeter lens. This is a manual option, but still, something for around 300 bucks is a solid buy. A glide cam iGlide, and I'm not too sure if you create any sort of content either in YouTube or for professional use. A GoPro Hero Plus, and that's right at $200 now. That's from last year's model. Bluetooth speaker, you've got a Philips BT6000A, $55 for some solid sound, I should say. Keeping things teal, you have a Nintendo 3DS, and I love your colorway. Love your pick that you included. Thank you so much. Entry number three, we've got Spiros, and it seems to be the common theme on today's episode where people have multiple MacBooks. You've got a 2016 MacBook Pro and an older gen MacBook. Drone-wise, you are rocking a DJI Phantom 3, and those have really dropped in price. They're around 440 bucks now, so it might be your go-to option for an entry-level drone. A Sony A6000, that's around 650 bucks, combining that with the kit lens an iPhone 6 in space gray. Once again, a solid phone choice. iPhone 7 is the way to go, in my opinion. An Apple Watch Sport. Once again, you're rocking the one with the leather band. Let me know how that one has been wearing. Your headphones of choice, the Beats Solo 2s. And once again, we've got the 3s out, so this is a solid option if you're on a bit of a budget. A Joby Gorillapod, right at $50. These seem to be super popular over here on Geared Out. An Amazon Echo Dot, which I think is a solid option, and this one is only 50 bucks if you don't want to buy the full-size one. And of course, a pair of shades, 
You've got some Armani glosses. Thanks for including those. I always love to see shades. Thank you very much, Spiros. Switching on to contestant number four. I feel like we're on the prices right here. We've got Tim, which I absolutely love your over the head shot. I think this one's my favorite of today's episode. To kick things off, you've got stuff compacted, a pair of Bose QC35s, and a UE Mega Boom for your Bluetooth speaker. You also have an iPhone 7, a Herschel wallet, and I see a lens poking out in the background, which you've got paired naturally with the Canon 70. Three lenses of choice. I see a 15 to 85 mil. I'll leave the other two linked down below. And of course, a pair of Ray-Bans. Those look like classic Wayfarers. And you also have a Peak Design backpack, which I actually just bought based off this picture alone. Thank you very much for your suggestion. And you've also included some accessories which you rock. I know these aren't Ultra Boost. They do have the Boost lining. Forgive me, I'm not a sneakerhead, but I will leave it linked down below. But this next contestant, number five, Victor, seems to be a sneakerhead. He's got all of his gear right on top of all of his shoe boxes. Kicking things off, you've got a MacBook Pro dbrand sticker with a Supreme sticker over top, sticker on sticker life. You also have a pair of headphones, ATH M40Xs, and these are solid for right under $100. A Pixel XL for your smartphone, seem to be living the Android life, and that's kind of floating. Let me know how you took that pic, I really like it. For wise, a lot of YouTubers have this one. This is the Panasonic G7, which takes outstanding video for its price, well under $1,000, highly, highly recommended, and still my favorite smartwatch of, I'm gonna even say this year, the Moto 360 second gen, and of course a pair of NMD tricolors. Sneakerhead, I know that you've got a YouTube channel. I will link that down below. Thank you so much, Victor. Okay, thank you everyone for submitting your content for episode 15 of Yeared Out. And just remember for my next episode, I do have something super, super special planned. So make sure you get your submissions in on time and I will try to get the best five entries for my next episode. So make sure you stay posted to that. Make sure you sub to the channel and I will catch the rest of you in probably that next episode or just another one here on YouTube. Peace.